see you back. Third quarter awards day is on the 10th. <laughs> Kindergarten through second is at 8.30 a.m. Third through fifth is at 9.15. Kindergarten pre-registration is on the 11th. All right, well, maybe we'll have some good news about our weather. Good morning, everyone. I'm glad to see you all back. Let's look into this week's forecast. Monday, we'll have a high of 66 with a low of 50. It's a mix of sun and clouds. Tuesday, we'll have a high of 66 with a low of 46, mostly sunny. Wednesday, we'll have a high of 68 with a low of 48. A sunny day is also to be expected. Thursday, we will have a high of 72 with a low of 50, mainly sunny. Friday, we will have a high of 70 with a low of 55, also another sunny day to be expected. Really good weather for this week. And when we come back, we will tell you the quote of the week. Thank you to our sponsors, Capstar Bank, for supporting DTN. For any of your banking needs, please go visit Capstar Bank Manchester, member FDIC, equal housing lender. Let's hear the quote of the week. The best way to predict your future is to create it. Abraham Lincoln. Next up, what we have on this day. Bye! Bye. Welcome back to On This Day. In 1972, US, USSR and 70 other nations agreed to ban biological weapons. In 1998, the Good Friday Agreement for Northern Ireland is signed by the British and Irish governments. In 2019, astronomers released the first ever image of a black hole, which is the center of, of the massive gal galaxy M87. In America, author F. Scott Fitzgerald published The Great Galaxy, which became a literal classic. In 1925, sixth member of family scumbums to poisoning after five members of his family. In film and TV history, on this day in 1956, Phillips broadcast first Dutch color TV programs. In 1957, 12 Angry Men directed by Sidney Lewis, starring Henry Fonda and Lee J. Cobb, is released. In 2014, The Amazing Spider-Man 2, directed by Mark Webb, and starring Andrew Garfield and Emma Stone premieres in London. And some famous birthdays on this day include Sophia Car mm -hmm. Sophia Carson, TV actress, David Harbour, movie actor, Bryce McKenzie, TikTok star, and Salazzo, YouTube star. That is all we have for you today. It's good being back with you guys. Let's get into the joke. <laughs> knock knock. Who's there? Alpaca. I'll pack a who? I'll pack of the trunk, you pack the suitcase. What do the birds call the owl telling jokes? Who hilarious. <laughs> How do you tell the difference between a bull and a cow? I don't know, Maddox. So, I don't know, Maddox. So, why don't you tell me? It's one or the other. <laughs> what do you call an elephant that doesn't? matter this joke is irrelevant two pickles fell out of a jar under the floor what did they say to the other i don't know what did the two pickles say deal with it how does a scientist freshen her breath i entered a pun contest i submitted 10 of my best puns to see if any would be a win however no pun intended did you ever notice ants don't get sick? It's because they're full of antibodies. <laughs> a bell with a watch is known as? I'm not sure. Tell me. It's a waste of time. <laughs> Which U.S. state is famous for its many sodas? Minnesota. <laughs> That's all the jokes we have. See you all next week. Bye. Bye.